A Illumina's mission is to improve human health by unlocking the power of the genome. And how we're contributing to that in reproductive and genetic health is to really understand the needs of reproductive biologists, clinical genetic testing labs, and delivering them really innovative technologies that support all their requirements from carrier screening and fertility testing, through doing enhanced genetic testing for improved IVF outcomes, to do testing through pregnancy. So um, we have a big focus on non-invasive prenatal testing, or NIPT, and then through to newborn screening and then testing throughout genetic disease. The other thing that, that Illumina is focusing on is really aligning the best solution to the needs of the customer. And in many cases, that's not necessarily a next generation sequencing solution. Sometimes it's an array for reasons of cost per sample, of throughput, of validated content, sometimes an array is the right solution. The best thing about the next Seq 550 is there's absolutely no compromise. So it delivers all of the performance of the most powerful desktop next generation sequencing platform, but then adds on the flexibility to support high resolution array scanning. Every single application that's available on the next Seq 500 can be enabled on the next Seq 550. So at one extreme, you can do a human genome sequence um, on the NextSeq 550. It's the only desktop, small format, next generation instrument that will actually do full human genome sequencing. You can of course also do exome sequencing, which is a focus for us in, in reproductive and genetic health, especially with TrueSite 1. You can do RNA-seq, you can do metagenomics applications, you can do methylation sequencing. Anything that's available through Illumina's broad portfolio of different applications is supported. So the data quality for the next Seq 550 is identical to the data quality we generate out of the next Seq 500. Effectively, it's the same instrument from a sequencing perspective. Our VeriSeq PGS solution is now becoming a standard for doing PGS. A lot of those same labs also want to do something called PGD. And so in that, the right technology to use is an array solution. It's the human carrier map 12. So you have a lot of these labs that want to use PGS on sequencing, and you want to do PGD on array. And now for the first time, you have one integrated solution on one platform that will support both applications. It is economics, it's space, it's simplicity of workflow. You learn one workflow, you learn effectively one instrument, you have a small bench footprint requirement, and so you get all of the value and all the benefits of multiple technologies, but in one integrated solution.